I'm looking forward to seeing everyone this weekend. It's going to be the last Sunday and talking about uh, an Easter parade that we've been on ever since we were up in the Galilee and Jesus turned his face toward Jerusalem. Today, of course, we're going to, or Sunday, we're going to be a week away from Easter, and the parade is going to look a little different. There's only going to be two people, two uh, disciples, who are on a seven-mile walk to a place called Emmaus from Jerusalem. They're trying to wonder, they're wondering about what's, what's happened that day. This is Easter Sunday. They've heard the story of the women finding the tomb um, empty, stone rolled away, disciples coming, some of the men coming to see it, and, uh, uh, but they just can't understand what's happened. And then all of a sudden a stranger appears and walks with them. And of course we know it's Jesus. Uh, they won't know it until they finally get to Emmaus. And during that time, he opens the scriptures to them and talks to them about everyone from uh, Moses through the prophets and how they all foretold what would happen with Jesus. When they arrive in Emmaus, he's going to walk on, but they invite him in, show him hospitality, and he takes bread and he blesses it, breaks it, and in the breaking, they see in an instant who it is. It's Jesus. What does it mean to be on a walk and allow a stranger to come into your life or to have Scripture be shared with you in a way that you've never imagined it before, but it gives your life meaning? Uh, come Sunday, and we're also going to have a time of communion. I can't wait to see you. God bless.